ban attack lands. Wait, I'm using attack lands. Ban my opponent's attack lands. They're disgusting. How's it going, boys? Today we are playing Boros Warriors of Standard. This is a very much aggressive deck. If we're playing against another aggro deck, we will outscale them, because we have things like Rally the Ranks, Paladin Class, and Showdown of Skulls. If it is not an aggro deck that we cannot outscale, and it's a control deck, well, I guess we'll just die then, uh, but we will put up a fight, like any good warrior should. And that's looking down on warriors, because uh, if you play an MMO and you play warrior, why? Why? You're just proving everything that's wrong with you by, you know, trying to create uh, the ideal virtual self. D -d -d don't do that. Play a wizard, or a rapist, or something along those lines. Well, most them, most wizards are the rapists. Uh, but anyway, back to magic. So, a lot of aggro. We have 12 one costs. Yes, you heard that right. 12 one costs. A fallen, a goblin, a goblin, a core goblin, and, you know, buff things. And these things also, by the way, keep on buffing. Yes, we have a lot of buffs here. Co uh, uh, Kargan War Leader, plus 1-1. One, one. Repli- uh, Resplendid Marshal, plus 1-1 one, one when you enter the field if you can exile something. Oh yes, this is one of those rare situations where you can legitimately use this card. When this card first came out, I thought it's gonna be amazing and a lot of people will use it. Uh, but turns out, no one does, because it's kinda garbage. By the way, I'm also still kinda contemplating just using uh, this Innistrad card the, uh, right here. Because it essentially does almost the exact same thing, but the condition is a lot easier and it has lifelink. But, you know, for each their own. So, you, if you want, you can play... You know what? No, 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 no. It, because it is a human scout. I will not do it, but honestly, I think replacing the Resplendent Marshal with this is better on many occasions. But I'm not gonna do that. A Legion's Angel for that sideboard, because also, it is a warrior. And, you know, the classical showdown of the Skulls. It is a pretty meaty deck, nothing to say here. With Paladin classes and Rally ranks, even if you're up against the control deck and they remove everything, well, you are threatening more or less lethal every single time you just drop something. Uh, Usher of the Fallen, amazing card, especially in combination with Rally ranks, because what this creates is a human warrior token, and you know, things like this. Essentially, we are really aggressive. Oh, and four Kabari takedowns. You know, why not, essentially? Why not? Against those pesky, pesky werewolf decks, essentially, most of the time at least. 24 lands to be specific, yes, we're not skimping out on lands, because, you know, it's actually mana intensive with Paladin class, the Usher of the Fallen. It is kind of mana intensive, so you don't want to be on 3 lands, you at least want to be on 4 or 5 lands with Sheldon of the Skulls, and things like that. But, with that being said, without further ado, like the video. YouTube really likes it when you like the video, and I like it when YouTube likes things that you do on my channel. It's a win-win situation, only takes you 5 seconds. And let's face it, the more you do it without me needing to remind you, the less time I have to spend each video reminding uh, that you need to do it. And maybe subscribe. Also, there's a link down to the Discord and Patreon down below. Also, there are links to Ether Hub decks. I upload every deck, so you know, if you're that person who says, Can we please get a deck list? Just, just click the Ether Hub link, please. It's so simple. So simple. Anyway, with that being said, without any further ado, let's just get a cracking and see what happens now, shall we? So. One, not exactly too sad of a thing, but it's pretty sad when you think about it. Uh, um, fast foods, you know, the extremely unhealthy kind. How many of them don't have a medium-sized french fries? They only have small or extra large or something like that. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's truly a disgusting o'clock. But, you know, a little bit sad, but not exactly heartbreaking. Funny, kinda-ish. 
And this is a good start, as you can see, because we will be able to drop Rally the ranks and Paladin class, and next turn buff up the Paladin class. So all of this will be absolutely slayly. Oh god, even more, huh? Wait a minute, the mana does not allow for this. Uh, oof. Let's see. Well, I'm still dropping this, I guess. And click the warrior thingy. Oh, yes. What you gonna do now? I said I will outscale almost any, uh, any creature deck. Because, you know, we're kind of meant to outscale almost any creature deck, so there you kind of have it. Oh, God, when... Oh, 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 look at that, boy. Look at that absolute spectacle. Uh, I will not be able to sadly do that, but you know what? I think this is good enough. I think this is good enough. Oh, he is not happy. <laughs> you can already tell that this guy is not happy. He just dropped the cosmic elixir. He's thinking to himself, life could be better. You know whose life is pretty good? Mine! Because Primal Milf said, well, you know, maybe I will allow you to take me on a date. Who knows? It's written in the stars or some fucking crap I said yes to anyway. Oh, but, boys, good times. Ooh, well, I guess it doesn't matter too much. So let me just pump this up one little bit and attack. He is so out of options, unless he has another white land and he can nuke me. But it doesn't seem like the thing, because look, he has two pathways where he had the chance to go double white, but yet he did not. Doesn't go for the block, very interesting, and by that I mean not really. But, okay, okay. I can level this up later on. He is gonna heal a bit, I have no idea what you are. Oh! I know what you are, you're cute! Yeah, that's pretty cute. Uh, do I want to... No, 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 I'm just gonna drop this, and then next turn I'm gonna go for it if I think it's a good idea. <laughs> Look at this! He needs to block everything. He needs to block everything. And only one of these... Wait, what? Block it. That's right. Block it. Okay, now it's pretty good. Even if he wipes, he's not going to be in terrific position, but, you know, if he wipes, I don't exactly have any more cards. I could potentially put in a couple of lands that do the killy-dilly thingy, but most of the time, meh, meh. Another one of these? Nah, I'm gonna upgrade. God, this this one's just, this one's just going uh, right then and there. Let's upgrade this one. Oh, yeah. He, he can't survive for long. Because he needs to block again everything. You still need to block, and now you're left with one HP. Are you gonna block that? Oh, that would be smart. That would be mega smart. Uh, but the problem with this is, I think this is a 4-4. Four four. So, you need to understand the facts here. The facts are, even if you wipe this this turn, this kills you anyway. I told you. Buffing Supreme. Oh, that's so cute! 10 out of 10, boys. 10 out of 10. Man, it has been ages since we last did a MILF update. Some people don't even know what the MILF update is, Jesus Christ. They have absolutely... Like, someone commented this once. Imagine being new to the channel and you do not know years of, uh, of MILF lore. <laughs> Ah, anyway, MILF of it. So, Primal MILF, 10 out of 10. Uh, Tide Gap MILF, still contemplating, still thinking about things, blah, blah, blah. You know, the, the casual stuff. Hey, it's not easy getting a woman to cheat on their husband just for fun. Hey, what, did you think I'm a goddamn saint? Obviously not. So, yeah, fun stuff. Oh, that's gonna be problematic if it happens. Oh, uh, but... Well, I have a den of the bugbear that I probably misplayed, uh, but probably, probable, no one cares. What are you gonna do? Nothing exactly, those are warriors, my dude. Uh, kinda expected that, but we do have huge advantages here. Oh, he got a, he, he got the flip. 
Oh, that's that's painful. Really? Negate. Negate. One more, one more absolute ludicrous creature with negate in the main board. Well, you know, whatevs. Just drop this. We are out DPSing him on virtually every and all levels of existence, so it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Oh, by the way, I did put in these lands, but, you know, it's not exactly necessary if anyone's wondering. The moment he kills something, I will most likely be able to use Resplendent Marshall, and it's gonna be good. And the 1-1 one, one token that this creates is a warrior, which means it's buffed by Rally Ziranku. I don't see a way he can actually win at this rate. <laughs> okay. Can we score three wins in a row? I think it is possible, but that game was pretty dodgy. Maybe our opponent could have almost gotten us, which would be devastating. Start Paladin, Class Core, Blade Master. Pretty good, pretty good. Also, again, if this is a creature deck, oh, we're absolutely peachy. If this is not a creature, oh god. Well, it's gonna be annoying. Which means, I don't honestly know what it means. If it's just, it's probably dimmer, right? No! It's no one cares, the color combination. Oh, suddenly I care a lot. Wow. I'll talk about a, a, a game plan ruiner. So, smartest thing, honestly, is get this to level 2. So, it's out of most casual uh, destruction effects. You know, that's that would be the smart thing to do. Uh, but, uh, actually, you know what? L no, no. I will not go for it. I sh- pro Eh, whatever, whatever, this is fine. Th this, this, this is absolutely fine. Negate. Good boy. Why do you roll with negate? It's such a stupid card. Like, seriously, who plays negate in standard? It just does nothing, the card. Congratulations, you did nothing. Are you proud of yourself? Well, you shouldn't be. This card is so niche, it's insane. Okay, so I'm assuming he removes this now because of reasons. If not, ooh! Well now, if not, then not, what can I say? Please, one land. Ah, yes, the casual 50 land combo. Loving it, McDonald's. But we should be at least. Okay, so. This is fine. <laughs> Yeah, you, you, you kind of can just see who this game favors, and that's probably not your boy. But if he does do nothing, I can just prog the... <clears throat> I can just prog that, and I think it's almost over. Oh, ho, ho! is that your whole turn? Oh, baby, boo! Yeah, that's not... that's... Wait, how much damage can I deal here? Oh my god, I can probably deal so much damage here. Do I? I still can play it? Wait, can I just... No. Wait! I win! Yeah, there's no way. Ta-da! Oh, it's just level 2. Okay, maybe may, maybe I got a uh, thing or two wrong, okay? It happens. It happens. But this should be still a win, because he needs to wipe everything, and I got two lands to turn into Goblin... I hate you so much. And he has another, which is probably the best thing ever. Ubu. <laughs> uh, by the way... This, uh, this kind of deck won the tournament, so 10 out of 10. Are you kidding me? Seriously? Is that any way to treat your fellow man? This card up to two cards and draw that many. Pretty good card, not gonna lie. Okay, do I want to go full-blown? No, I want to do this. And I'm honestly just gonna play it as this. So, now this guy, well, he, he just continues to be annoyed. Also, that's a 2-2. Two, two. <laughs> ah, 3 HP, what up, buttercup? 
You can use summon removal. Oh, you didn't. Okay. If you don't find three extra turns, you're gonna lose. That's just the reality of the subject. So, not looking good for our boy here. Look at this! I didn't even know which level was Paladin class and I'm still winning games. 10 out of 10, the Grand Magic Player of the Century. It was my tutelage that made whatever his name is win the Magic Grand Prix Tour or whatever the stupid tournament's called. By the way, boys, how many of you think the tournament is completely botted, view-wise? Because it is. Because it is. Yesterday I went on Twitch and I saw that the tournament, it was the finale, I think. I, it had like, what? 50k views peak or something? Poker God, by the way. 50k views peak, I think, or something like that. Which is, well, which is, quite frankly, absolutely abysmally disappointing. And not to mention, if you go into, like, if someone, if someone streams you bought it, it's pretty easy to see if they have uh, done it lazily. Because a view botted stream will always uh, always have a very slow chat. And man, that arena chat in Twitch was the, the equivalent of 500 people, honestly. I'm sure that there were more viewers than that, but man. Oh. When, when, when you need to view bot your tournament because it's so shit. And that production value was absolutely atrocious. So, 10 out of 10 everything. Uh, counterspell this if you can. He may, because, you know, what's the chance that he has a pipe for this? Yes! That is so perfect, because he was afraid of that. And now we just press uh, the warrior button. This is extremely, extremely good. Because... Well, if he has what I put in my deck, he can remove all of this with 3 man. Now he can't. Now he loses. Ah, yes. And by the way, I already compared my Is It deck to the winning, uh, winning, uh, winning deck. I got someone to link it in Discord. My deck is so much better. My deck is literally so much better than that Is It deck that won the tournament. It's not even a comparison. Man, if Wizards did not prevent me from rightfully playing in that tournament, I would have fucking just swept it like a little shit. Magic is a children's card game, and I'm not a child. At least that's what I say, my, uh, say to myself. But it's fine. Oh, that's so cute. Look at that. Having that gold spam dragon in the opening hand. Aren't you a champion? I will die like a champion. GG. And by the way, I can only talk about that deck now because, well... Yesterday was the end of the tournament when this uh, when that video got recorded. So you know it is what it is. Good start with the Gobbo. Uh, let's see what he does. Core Blade Master would be absolutely sugoi. Ah, uh, the saddest thing in the land. This is what happens when you use lands like this. Also, that's why I'm also not a fan of it. But you know it. Oh, <laughs> oh, solo. Yeah, that's not gonna work out, Chief. Oh, you just milled good cards. I hate you. Well, it's fine. It, it is absolutely fine. Because, you know, what is he gonna do? This is already five times too much damage. Like, the moment I drop these two bad boys, it, it's over. It's over. Oh, by the way. Rally the ranks is a ma uh, mostly is not good for things like this. This is a rare exception where it's good because we are using, you know, alternative cards to make it work. But Rally the ranks usually is not good when it comes to decks like this. You want creatures to buff your things. That is the best choice of action in like almost all circumstances. Uh, but... This time, it's not bad because, again, we have, uh, we have Fight of the Skull, Showdown of the Skulls. And that's pretty good. That makes this card viable. But usually it's a little bit too slow, so, you know, you can't exactly use it constantly. But in this case, it's fine. 
Okay, ooh, expressive intel, whatever. If you can't counterspell me, it's over. If you can't remove all of this instantaneously, it's over. Because, you know, let's face it, what are the chances that you have the three cost? Really, dude? Really? Is, is that... <laughs> dude! I'm legitimately surprised we won that game, by the way. Because most of the time I have played against that mill deck. Oh, it has not go gone my way. Oh, it has absolutely not gone my way. It has gone pretty much the exact opposite way. Hello there. Well now. How about this? Again, if you start boasting against the control deck like this. Oh, you are... It, it's so annoying. Most decks can't deal with that. Oh. <laughs> oh. Just, just sadness. Okay, do I want... Yeah, I'm just gonna do it like this. I think this is the most damaging play in the history of ever, probably. So, you know, just boast again. He's thinking, well, it's damage, but it's not a lot of damage. And then, bam! The absolutely will never get married creature gets dropped, and it's over. Yeah, he's probably thinking, man, I did a good job. Only three damage, what could possibly... Bam. Bam. You, you say you don't want to do it with big girls? Well, that's not for you to decide, as they say. Wait a minute. Uh, is there a chance he counterspells? Nah. Nah. Nah, man. That's not a counter spell, but I'm still frustrated. Good enough. Still did damage. What are you gonna do? Environmental science me? Oh, please. Please don't get a land. Damn it. They always get a land with exp expressive iteration. What a, what a, what a by the way, zoomer card. Ah, oh, it's like the poster boy of ADHD. ADHD. It's hilarious, wizards. It's hilarious. Okay, drop this. He will be forced to try and find a solution because, you know, let's face it, reasons. And, well, then we just win because reasons. Showdown of Skulls and look at this aggro schmagro hand. It's, it's glorious. Okay, no one asked you to do that, though. Kind of, you know, close to doing stuff, but still. Okay, exile a land, please. I need to buff this bad boy. Okay, I was not even that bad. Yeah, I was not even half bad. Right, this is gonna be a little bit problematic now. I need to also drop this. Well, it almost looks like we don't have any red in the hand. Ah, uh, Battle of Frost and Fire. It's a really good card. It does so much. It does so much. Okay, how am I gonna do this, though? I can't try and go for the play where we just buff the fallen hero to such overextensive reaches that it's just unreasonable. Or we could just lose here. But I just ranked up, so it, it, technically it's kind of fine. <laughs> Ooh. Well, that's kind of useful. Drop it like it's hot. Now drop this. Let's see. Oh! No counter spell, you say? Well, in that case, let me just do this. I want this on 4 or 5 HP, so it's really hard to get rid of. Well, it's not gonna be that hard to get rid of, but hey. At least it's gonna be something, you know? Exile that. Everything gets a little bit of a plus sign on it. Amazing. And if worst comes to shove, like, if he does not- Ah, oh, he does have some. Damn it. Well, it's still buffed. It's still buffed. And unless he starts playing a lot of extra turn mechanics, it's not like he can do anything about this. Not to mention I have a Paladin class, which he is most likely uh, woefully ill-prepared. And still gonna get a bunch of plus one- Don't, don't, don't! Well, I am buffing him a little bit, so that will ruin a little bit of your whatever cadavers. Okay, that's also dual uh, double strike, so uh, good, good, good luck there, chief. 
Uh, let's do it like this. He needs to counterspell this or choose... Oh! Did we get it? Yeah, we got it, boys. Wait, is this five or six wins in a row? I think it is. Did we lose a game? I don't think we did. did. You go first. Also, currently, it, something, something, I'm going first so often it kind of makes me feel a little bit uncomfortable about myself. Another one. Man, everyone's playing that winner, winner, chicken, dinner is a deck. How will I uh, clickbait my, uh, my video, though? <laughs> that, that, wait. I can't play pal. Oh, I can't play pal. Okay, that's sad. Okay, so there was no benefit in doing that, but whatever. So how will I clickbait my is it deck? Because the timing was perfect. The timing was absolutely pitch perfect. Oh, you're not a counterspell deck now. Ho 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 ho! Ah, that's where you have went wrong, my dude. Well, it's your own fault for not being counterspell. Are you kidding me? Did you just push back a goblin? Why would you touch a goblin? Except if it's touching a goblin with lightning, then it's okay. Ah, oh, you poor, poor creature feature. Let me just do this. Counterspell it, I dare you. Come on, I know you're, I know you're afraid. I can feel the afraidness under that hood. You goddamn failed LARP of Belial. Pfft, disgusting! Oh, divide by... Z you are absolutely... I hate you. Wait, didn't we already see this? Is this a repeat? Is this the revenge of whatever that, that guy's name was? It honestly could be. Fuck. So the problem with pushback is extremely dubiously simple. Pushback's really annoying. But... Man, he is getting the ramp, and he will soon be able to tap that completely hashtag extremely balanced land hashtag balanced. So I don't like that, but again, he can't exactly deal with what I'm currently doing. Unless he counterspells this, which he does not do. Good boy, good boy. Drop this. I think I'm gonna do the take uh, do the takedown as a land. We currently have not ever used it, but it's mostly against verbal decks, honestly, so there you have it. You think he's gonna carriage block? Because that would be hilarious. Oh my god, you're legitimately carriage blocking me. Ten out of carriage with carriage again. So I'm a yeah, I'm gonna do this. You may say that that's strange that I do it, but look, he's dropping another carriage. That's why he did it. And if he's dropping another... AGAIN WITH THE STUPID SERPENT BULL! Oh my, I hate it, it's so annoying! Okay, okay, I I'm doing this, there's nothing else, there, there is absolutely nothing else. Exile, top, blah, no one cares, blah, blah, blah. Oh, the, the... Currently, my biggest loss rate, I think, is just against people who drop coma on perfect curvature. Not gonna lie, infuriating AF. The good part is, well, he still can't technically deal with this. And man, we have a lot of MacGuffin magics here. If I buff this to uh, 7, he can't actually coma kill it. Which is cools. 10 out of 10. Oh, you're out of- yes! Oh, I hate you so much, you disgust me, you freak of nature. Okay, good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cobra summons thingies. No one cares. Okay, ooh, another one. And that's pretty on point, not gonna lie. So, drop a gobbo. Buff. Can I drop? No, I can't do all of it. Okay, I'm gonna do it like this anyway. So, do that. I can exile this gobbo and we're absolutely chillin'. Okay, so do I wait more? I have another showdown of Skulls, so it's not exactly bad. Uh, but, 
I actually had the mon I didn't think I have. So, oh, what? I told you, boys. It's outscale o'clock. Look at this madness. It's Granger at its finest. Block it. See what happens. Block it. Start blocking, bitch. Yeah, that's right. How many... I'm gonna choose the cannon and it's gonna die and the comb is not gonna kill it. You need to block this with everything. Oh, that's not how blocking works, my... My twisted, twisted feature creature. Yeah, okay. This and that. Seven? Yeah, that's okay. Wait a minute. No, no, no. This is still fine. This is still fine. Yeah, sack it. No one cares. Oh, oh, invulnerable. Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, I'm, I'm sure that matters. I'm sure that matters. So, what are you? So, what's your plan for next turn, enemy kun? Oh, you don't. You also need to ditch this, or you're absolutely dead. Also, you can't block the goblin, or you're absolutely dead. Now, ain't that an amazing situation to be in? Huh, who would have thought, right? God, I hate you. I hate everyone who plays Comb, it's just annoying. It is so truly annoying. <laughs> okay, yeah, do that. Wait, I can... Oh, that's a lot of MacGuffins. Okay, so chances are he can't do anything against that, right? Well, what does it even matter at the end of the day? Because it doesn't... Because it doesn't. He's thinking. Thinking of a better time when he didn't have to verse a goddamn monster like me. Well, it's his own choice to play magic. Well, technically, I also play magic, which makes me an idiot, but hey. But hey. Uh, let's see. Puff this. I don't care to go for that, he still needs to block everything in this guy. Also, that thing has haste, so... Essentially, it doesn't matter if we put all of our eggs in a uh, Dresplenished Marshall basket, or does he... Yeah, does he knock something back? You know, he's... There's absolutely no... Dude, I have nothing in my hand. I have absolutely nothing of value in my hand. Wait, what? Oh, you can do that. Well, no one cares to play! Block it, sunshine. Block it. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That is absolutely fine. Nope. Do it like this. You know why? Oh, it can actually choose what to attack. Uh... Wha 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 whatever. So, the question now is... How do I do this? Do I hit the face? Because face is the place. Oh, he did the double, huh? Okay, so now the trick is simple. He needs to top deck something extremely fast. And when he has only one of these things, well... You know, problems, essentially. Oh no, he... Oh, God damn it, sister. Stop playing... GARBAGE! Yeah, you're not getting anything. That's just life. Deal with it. Oops. Yeah, this is not in my hand. Oops is correct. So, how much can I do here? Oh, that's a warrior, huh? Man, I'm, I'm liking this. Okay, I will outscale him. That's like, uh, unquestionable reality of life currently. Which makes it all the more hilarious. Was that the right play? Probably, probably. No one cares. No one knows. No one knows. But, you know, now I'm gonna get more things that fly and hit face. <laughs> ah. So, what now? Yeah, you got some blockers, but, you know. What now? How much can you block? Okay, okay, you did it, you, you blocked it, big deal. He could have actually went and did it a, a little bit different, but I'm... Again, I actually don't legitimately care. <laughs> the fact of the matter is, unless he top dicks spectacularly, he is not achieving a victory here.
Plus I have these lands that do land stuff. And I have two of these, which technically means he cannot block the goblin no matter what. Okay. Do you feel good about yourself? Okay, do you feel extra good about yourself or something? Well, he got a lick in. Oh. Ah, uh, well now. That's great and everything, but where is my Buffy thing? I don't see my Buffy thing. There it is. Yeah, that's... Oh, wait! He can actually block it! No! No, 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 no way. No way, Jose. He, he can block it with... Are you kidding me? God damn, he can block it with a stupid Hydra... Ban attack lands! Wait, I'm using attack lands. Ban my opponent's attack lands! They're disgusting! Kill yourself! And also, it's a goblin, I forgot about that. <laughs> because I don't have this level 2. Okay, now I need to ditch 3 cards. Yeah, that's absolutely great. 10 out of 10 wizards, 10 out of goddamn 10. I can't- wait, I can't ditch the flyers, can I? Oh my god, this is annoying. I can't ditch also the first strikes. Dude, there's so much bad things for me to ditch, it's insane. Oh my god. Dude! This card is so annoying. Oh! Wait, am I dead? Yeah. Attack lands should always 100% be banned. There you go. Even when you're using attack lands, someone else is gonna be using attack lands and you're not gonna like it. Hashtag I hate attack lands. Anyway, that's pretty self-explanatory, I guess. But how did you like the deck? It's a pretty good deck, I would like to say. We won a lot of games. It's very aggro heavy and it has very many buffs. So yeah, I like it. I enjoyed it. Anyway, this was Quizzer Sensen. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel. Check out the Discord. And I can't wait for the people. You could have won the last game if you did it to me. I know. I know. D do you really think I think that, you know, this could this should be used anywhere but face in a deck I, ha I know has no healing? Think again, sunshine. Anyway, this was Quizzer Sensen. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel. Check out Discord. Check out the Patreon. Like the video and have a nice day. Bye-bye.